Hi everybody, I am back today. I hope everybody had a, a nice, a happy New Year's Eve and New Year. Um, I always get together with a few of my closest friends um, and I had to cancel because I was sick and Damien's sick now. So I had to cancel it, unfortunately, but I'll see them soon. I'll, I'll make another date <clears throat> and we'll get together. So I hope everyone had a, a, a nice time celebrating. Um, <clears throat> well, I figured I'll, I'll just do a haul video. Uh, I'll show you some things that I picked up. So, uh, I haven't gotten out of the house in four days. So, um, I decided just to go to Hobby Lobby today really quick. And I really wanted to stay home, actually. As soon as I went there, I wanted to go home. But, um, I picked up a few things, so I'll show you what I got. Um, and, you know, Valentine's stuff is out now, and it's 40%. I really liked this ribbon because it's got the hearts, and it's really glittery. The hearts are glittery, and I like to do that for, um, I like to buy this kind of stuff to make my, um, tassels. <clears throat> So I picked that up, and I have a lot of Valentine stickers already, but these are these are cute that came in. They're chunky red and pink glitter. So I picked these up. I picked up the seals. They're hearts. It says "Be Mine, Love," <clears throat> and XOXO in different shades of pink and red at the bottom. I love epoxy stickers. I just love epoxy stickers. And they had these hearts. So I, I uh, picked these up. thought those were really pretty. And these donuts are really cute. So I picked the donuts up. And then um, these heart stickers were cute too. So I picked those up. And then Christmas is 75 off. So I picked up um, a couple of packages of these because there's really not much to them, but you can use these things. You could put these little ornaments and gingies on cards or dress up, dress up a project you're making. So I picked up a couple of those. <clears throat> and then during Christmas, I had um, a gift card actually... I got one more thing from the jewelry shop. Um, jewelry shop was half off, so I, I picked up some of these for my pokey tools. All right, um, and that was it for that. But then um, I did some shopping on scrapbook.com. And I'll show you those goodies that came in. So I got all this stuff with gift cards. <clears throat> Um, I don't have any dyes like this, just bows like this, and I thought this was really cute. So I picked up these bow dyes, and you get quite a few different kinds over here. Sometimes you just need a little paper bow to dress something up, you know? So I thought that was a good idea. I got this Tim Holtz stencil. I thought this was really nice. I don't have this one. I'm trying to see what this one's called. <clears throat> but it doesn't have a name on it. So I got this one. Now I should have got more of these. This is the Halloween transparencies. And look at all those cute bats that came in it. So this is what you get. You get all these these things and they're all transparencies. I should have I should have got more of these. Because that's really cool. I didn't though. And then uh, I got the Tim Holtz Deer Dye. You get a quite a few different sizes of the deers. Mama, baby, and dad. And I thought those were really cute to have in my stash. And I got this haunted house, which it looks like there's a lot of dyes here. You know how I am with that. But that'll be cool. I mean, I had to get it. That'll be awesome. And it even comes with the steps down here. So I had to get that. I had to get more of these deco frames. I use these a lot in my journals for name. I use them as nameplates. 
The only one I really don't like is this one, and I have a lot left over of this one. I don't care for it. Not for the, not for the front of my journal. I don't like that one. I, I use it inside sometimes, but for the front, I don't like that one. I also have owl dies and stamps, and I thought they would go great with this 3D uh, embossing folder of the wood. I thought that would go really great with that. <clears throat> and then I bought from Tim Holtz Stampers Anonymous. I got this um, spiderweb rubber stamps. And everyone knows I hate rubber stamps. I'm sorry I do. I hate them. But they work the best. They do. I have to say, they work the best. And at least with the Tim Holtz ones, it's not clear up here. So you can actually see the, you can see the stamp. A lot of times this would not have an image on it. And you wouldn't know, you know what's going on. So I do have the Tim Holtz cats, the stressed out cats. The big rubber stamps I do have that in my stash and now I have all these cool spider webs because who doesn't want a good spider web stamp I have some dies I needed stamps and these are gonna be awesome to use so that's what I got and you know I was a little bummed out because stampbook.com scrapbook.com I'm sorry they always give you something free at least one or two things free, depending on how much you spend. And I know, uh, I know you have to click the thing to get it free, but I could have sworn I checked off to get something for free and nothing came in. And I feel bad, so now I don't have anything free. I think it was some Christmas thing. So I feel bad about that, but I don't want to contact them either because <clears throat> I know I checked it off, but then I was having problems checking out. So when I finally checked out, I didn't know if I clicked it again for the free item. I know I did it the first time, but I'm not positive if I did it the second time. So what am I going to do? Call them and say, hey, I didn't get my free gift. I'm not going to, eh, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. So this was my little haul that I did, and there'll be more, because I have a lot of gift cards to Michael's, I got one for Joann's, so there'll be more hauls coming up, I really wanted to craft something today, because I'm feeling a little bit better, um, but now, Toby bit me, because Toby's in rut right now, and that's when they're in their mating season, he's three years old, and this is his first time going through rut, and they get very aggressive, all right, they, you know, they're all over the place. So I was trying to calm him down. Now, he's been in rut now for almost a good month. I've never gotten bitten. But the other day, I was patting him, you know, trying to, like, put his head down and try to pet. I had to blanket over him, and I'm patting his back, trying to calm him down. And he just went, ah, he popped up from the blanket, and boom. He grabbed right onto my thumb. I lifted my hand up. He's dangling. It was bad, so I got bit hair, hair, and hair. So I have three puncture wounds from good old Toby. I can't put any pressure on this. It looks good. It doesn't look infected. I am taking care of it. But the littlest thing, whether I stretch it or I can't put any pressure down, kills. So how am I going to craft doing that? Guys, I can't win. So <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how long it's going to take. I can try to maybe craft something uh, and see how it goes without my thumb. I don't know if I can, like, I don't know, guys. I'll have to try it. But that's my week so far. <clears throat> so, yeah, I'm a little better. My throat's a little bit sore still. I got a little bit more energy. But now we got this big bite. So <laughs> I can't win. So... I'll be doing another video as soon as I can. Uh, I did get some good dyes in for, for uh, Valentine's that I wanted to try. Like, I got these, this shaker heart thing. I really wanted to try this from Chaos Crafts. No, this one's from ZF Party. Sorry, I thought it was Chaos Craft. But, and I got some words, too, over here. But I, I can't do anything right now. <laughs> so, bear with me. 
Thanks for watching. Happy crafting. And I'll catch you, catch you again real soon, hopefully. <laughs> Bye.